Hello and welcome back to Public Enema Plays and this Maguri mod playthrough of Final Fantasy IX. And we are jumping in here with Zidane and company leaving Vermicia, and we are on our way to Clara. Trying to track down Kuja and, you know, party looking for Dagger. Unbeknownst to them, she's back in Alexandria. Last time we were with this set of heroes, they, uh, they got worked over pretty well by Beatrix of Alexandria. Pretty unique setting for uh, the settlement of Clara. Up in a giant tree, surrounded by a sandstorm in the middle of the desert. Not an easy place to invade. The tempest subsides. By the gods. Come on, let's go while we can. Indeed, let us press on. Must hurry, must find yummy yummies. get behind living in a giant tree, that's kind of cool, but the whole middle of a sandstorm thing feels like it would be problematic. Hermesian, or Clayron, you know, the rat race in this game. You either live in the land of eternal rain, or a place where there's sand everywhere. chest there. Ice staff, which we already have. Magician shoes, I don't know if we have. It's a good thing for Bibi. Oh, I want him to learn antibody, though. For Oman Quina. Ten percent can be pretty handy. We are headed. We'll, we'll hold on to. Maybe we'll run into an enemy that causes confuse quite often. Then we can switch over. It's here. It's kind of taking my time because there are a few enemies here that we definitely want to encounter for uh, blue magic purposes. Ice magic is very effective against these uh, insect type enemies. Enough for Vivi to one hit KO. There is one enemy here that's an absolute pain that I'm sure we will run into. Last time I came through here, I branched differently and couldn't remember if I had missed anything or not. Good to know I didn't. Now what? It's so dark, I can't see a thing. Stick your hand in there. <clears throat> Uh-oh, sand's coming. I don't think there's anything 
Let's get in the fight here. Alright, this is the enemy that's a pain. Strange people came into town and destroyed the entire place. What the heck's going on, Koopo? I don't want to see any more pointy hats. One off should be careful, too. Maybe you should move elsewhere. Things are terrible, Maurizio. Koopo. Are we going to be okay here, Koopo? No letters from the lab. so much more difficult on myself because I would never use magic except for boss fights. So just imagine going through this entire area where Bibby's basically one hit KOing everything we run into and not using Bibby for what he's good for. Jelly 
Where is Zidane? Not super useful here. But will be someday. That's the best glove we got. For now. Those are boots, which I believe we already have. Get your chest back here. Where we need our best. Probably throw that on. Ooh, auto pushing. What's the here to where we can get a... Uh, I feel like there was a chest we saw and we could not quite reach. I wonder if we can get to it now. I don't know how to get up there. There's two chests up there. Yeah, I missed something. Vivi to attack through like all the regular battles and save up all that magic point for the boss and then get to the end of the game and have, you know, like 99 ethers that I never used. So as I've gotten older, I've tried to to break that habit of 
hoarding items and you know, only using power moves, you know, for bosses. I got the ethers, why not? This game's pretty generous with them. It's not like some of the older Final Fantasies where they cost so much. Still waiting for the encounter with the giant bird. That a high potion. Oops. Ah. There we go. Let's get sucked in. I can't remember what happens. We fight some scorpions. first attack and I'll be able to do anything with it. Alright, here's our guy.
right, got it. It's nice having a healing spell in Quinn's hip pocket. Although, I guess it implies that Quinn had just ate Freya. version of like a, a turducken a zoo stuffed with a rat inside of a Q's body now. Alright, welcome to Clara. Might you be Lady Freya? Indeed, I am. We have awaited your coming, my lady. How did you come to know my identity? King of Remesia has requested that we guide you to him. Long live the king. Take me to him immediately. At once, my lady. The dawn, I shall go see the king. Why not take this chance to rest? Yeah, good idea. This way, my lady. I'm going to be your guide and show you the town. Yes, please. Please walk this way, sirs. I go find yummy yummies by myself. This is our source of water. I shall elaborate later on how we have water up so high. Now, for our next stop. This is the liveliest part of our town. But there's no market today, so the usual crowd is gone. Let's move on. They're clerical hats. When I was a kid, I thought the clarins looked more like birds than rats for some reason, even though I knew they were related to Bernicia. That's just how baby public enemas mind work. This windmill brings the blessings of water to our humble town. It uses the power of the sandstorm to pump water up from the ground. Now, next I shall show you the observatory. Maybe just with the Maguri mod, it's a little bit easier to see their rats. I just thought they looked very beak-like. The observatory is where citizenry, where the citizenry comes to relax. Here, we observe our protector, the sandstorm, and here, we pray to it. Next is the cathedral, the last stop on our tour. The high priest who brings peace to our souls resides in the cathedral. King of Bermesia and Lady Freya are meeting inside this building. It also houses the harp whose magic stone powers the sandstorm. Let us make our way back. And that concludes the tour. Thanks a lot. Maybe I should ask her to show me around again. I've been a guide in ages. I don't get a whole lot of visitors here. Spending money before we go explore. Yeah, that's all there is here. Another Phoenix pin down. Works as a Phoenix down inside battle, but it has another use that we'll get later on. No yummy yummies. This town. No yummy yummies anywhere. You can, <laughs> you know, can make famous Alexandrian dish, Queen's meal. You know, have famous Southgate bunt cake. It's my first time away from home. 
Can't stand the sandstorm. It's too loud. Will we ever see Bermesia again? Hey, I remember meeting you in Bermesia. If there's anything I can do, just ask me. I hope we didn't already have that. Seeing Soldier Dan. It's gonna be a major upgrade for Zidane. I decided to start a small theater, but I ain't had any luck finding actors. You know any good actors who are looking for work? Man, how I wish you all were here. Come to think of it, you Tantalus guys look like a bunch of outlaws. Just kidding. Yuko, is she looking for actors? I want to become an actor. Closer. You demon, leave my family alone. You're a mushroom. Mushroom. I never see this kind of mushroom before. I hope it's edible. Go back and check on Bibby. Hides in here. Oh, maybe not. Yes, we saw on the way up the tree, Vivi can take care of himself. Ah, this is why I thought he went in the end. You bastard! You killed my father! Bastard! 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 Well, well, a bit touchy today, aren't we? He's one of the demons that sacked Bermesia. I, I haven't heard anyone. Maybe. Are you a friend of that strange, apron-clad individual? Guilty. I wonder where she... He learned to speak so strangely. Where to start? Clara has not seen visitors for hundreds of years. I don't, I don't think we need anything in particular. Find a couple of deals. sandstorm that protects our town is powered by magic. Keep the storm in motion, we perform a sacred dance to the melody of a harp adorned with a magic stone. Hope everyone who stayed in Bermesia is doing okay. Only a tiny fraction of us made it here to clear. Damn it. 
those thunder gloves I literally just bought. I think that goes back to the entrance I've got over here. So Vivi's in here now. Yeah. I've never done anything bad. Explored Playera to the extent we're going to explore Playera. See a lot of the paths wind together. Playera people are kind of stiff, but they're nice once you get to know them. I'm so happy the Claverans decided to take us in. In days of old, the folk of Playera and Bermesia lived under the same sky. Clarence fled to the street to avoid a conflict with the Bermesians, who began the value of the arts of war. The game doesn't really go into it, but it's implied in some of the lore that Bermesia and Alexandria have fought before. Bermesians are like us Clarence, and that they both and that both societies value dance. Our tradition, however, is older, thus our dances evoke greater power than those of Bermesia. Check in on Rhea at the cathedral. I have a message for Master Zidon from Lady Freya. I was told to convey the following. Zidon, this may take some time, so please wait at the end. Alright. Yellow scarf. What's hiding? way this time. Help! What is the matter? The antlion's mauling a kid. The antlion? It's usually so docile. How could... We gotta teach that beast a lesson. This calls for immediate action. I shall inform the High Priest at once. Hey, buddy, but where are you going? These Clarins are all so damn lazy. You there, give me a hand if you think you're good enough. Am I good enough? Kids being attacked by an antlion. Another potion on the dawn. Alright, let's do this. So that's the antlion. Ah, help me! No! Hang in there, champ. We're gonna save you. Is the child alright, Zadon? Yeah, he's fine. Like hell, I'm fine. That voice. Might it be Prince Puck? Freya, where you been? That hurt, you stupid jerk. Here it comes. Steal again first. 
Harvest. upon leaving Bermesia. Uh, yeah. Well, let us go at once to the cathedral to inform his majesty. My old man, huh? Nah, I don't want to see him. Just tell him I said hi, okay? Later. Let your highness. Take care, Vivi. It's so rude. Vivi much nicer. He's the first friend I ever had. I've got to tell him something. I see. So you saw Puck, eh? As mischievous, as mischievous as ever, your majesty. I haven't seen him in ages. I heard his highness left Bermesia one month after me. That makes it three years. And yet both you and Puck decided to return to me in this time of danger. I am grateful. <laughs> Freya, we shall conduct an ancient ceremony to strengthen the sandstorm. Surely no enemy of ours would attack powerful storm protecting Clara. And with the help of a dragon knight like you, the storm should grow even more powerful. Ah, the ceremony from the time when Bermesia and Clara were born. I understand. Zidane, I met with utter failure when trying to defend Bermesia. I will not allow Braun to exert her will upon us any longer. You've changed, Freya. I didn't think you were so strong when I first met you could not bring peace to Bermesia and thus fulfill Sir Fratley's wish. But now, all I can do is protect this beautiful place. Yeah, protecting Clara is the best thing you can do for yourself. Doing so will help me. Time for some Final Fantasy River Dance. that much of a difference. And they even have rat tails. Seven remake with Cloud at the Honeybee Inn, just with Freya instead. The strings have snapped. A terrible omen this is. Sandstorm disappeared. What happened? I don't know. I have never witnessed anything like this since we settled here. On the harp, there is a magic stone. The 
since ancient times we have used the power of the stone to control the sandstorm. Perhaps someone is trying to invade Clara. I fear that you may be right, my lord. I only hope our enemies don't come up the trunk. How dare they imprison us like this? Those wretched court gestures. Zorn and Thorn will never get away with this. I can't believe I got dragged into this. No one asked you to meddle in our affairs. It's pretty sad getting backstabbed by your own queen. This is all some kind of a mistake. I know the queen. She would never betray me. Wishful thinking. Who knows what she's going to do with the, to the princess. I must save the princess at all cost. I wonder if mother will even listen to me. Why did she attack Bermesia? Why did she arrest us like this? I must be sincere with her. She hasn't been herself lately. Actually, she's been acting rather strange since my birthday last year. The same day that tall man visited us. Maybe he had something to do with it. Come to think of it, that was when things began to change. Dr. Tot left Alexandria shortly afterwards, too. What happened that day? Bron summons you. Come with us. What? How dare you speak to me like that? Quiet. With us you are coming, and that is that. What was that phrase? Oh yeah. Get off of me, you scumbag. What was that? I do not understand. Understand what she said, I do not either. Enough. Now come with us. Hurry up. For so long the queen has waited. Mother. Darling, there you are. Where were you? I've been worried sick. Here, come closer. Mother. There is something I need to ask you. What is it, darling? I will tell you anything you wish to know. Did you? Is it true that you are responsible for the destruction of Bramesia? Oh. Well, no wonder you look so concerned. That is far from the truth, Garnet. You see, those Bramesian rats have been plotting to destroy Alexandria for some time. I couldn't just wait for them to attack and destroy our precious kingdom. So I had no choice but to take initiative. Mother, is that really the truth? Of course. I would never lie to you. I don't believe you. Oh, darling, what's wrong? Why wouldn't you believe your mother? May I also play a part in this act? Act? Yes, an act from a beautiful play. There's a knight on a white horse beautiful princess that is a tale of tragic love. Overcome by grief, the princess must sleep for a hundred years. You, I've seen you before. It appears we were destined to meet again. My sweet angel, come to me. I will take you to a world of dreams. He is beautiful even in sleep. <laughs> Impudent little girl. Zorn, Thorn, prepare to extract the Eidolons from Garnet. Belated happy birthday, princess. Hee hee hee. Sixteen years old, the princess has become. Draw the Eidolons from her, finally, we can. Eidolons of eternal life, the infinite power, arise from sixteen years sleep. Let there be light, let there be life. The time has come, the time is now. Come forth, 
Odin, warrior of the dark. What are you doing here? Tell me, why do you think the sandstorm disappeared? I don't know. I was surprised that there even was a sandstorm. Did you know the sandstorm was here for a thousand years? And in all that time, it never disappeared. Not even once. Perhaps Bronn is behind all this. Let's see, no doubt Bronn was behind this. What about that guy who was with Bronn? Right now my mind's only on Dagger. Actually, I'm more concerned about who that guy with Bronn and Bramecia was. That man. I wonder who he was. Zidon, I'm going to head down and find out why the sandstorm disappeared. Hey, I was thinking the same thing. Let's go together. I'm going to go find Vivi and Quinna. I'll meet you at the town entrance. Bring Freya for a minute. Hold on until we learn Ray's wind. Actually. Let's go ahead and throw on this gold helm. Then we can upgrade our weapon too. Just leaving that for my boots. So we don't need chainmail. We jump straight up to the lethal armor. Ether and Phoenix Pinion. Thanks to you, kid, I can continue my journey. Letter from Monev. People are climbing up to Clara since the sandstorm disappeared. Kupo, I have a bad feeling about this. What's going to happen? Will Clara end up like Bramecia? Isn't there anyone who can help us? That sounds awful. Kupo, I'm going to pack and leave with Stiltskin. Save on here. Could stop here, but I'm gonna push on a little bit further. It means this session's a little bit long, that's okay. We've done a lot, but I wanna do a little bit more. the game. Hey, what took you so long? Alright, let's get going. I couldn't find Puck. I wonder if he went down the trunk. The city has very yummy sand. This city delicious. I failed Bermesia, but I won't fail Clara no matter what. A lot of Quinna eating sand. That's pretty funny. Sugar white sand. Alright. Start learning fire, huh? Almost have jelly learned. different than the way we came up. Alexandrian soldiers. Do we know what the Moogle meant 
by people climbing up the trunk. Probably sub something out on her. We have anything better? I actually don't. I'll pull those off for somebody else. For the desert boots. Alexandrian villains back there. Weren't they too few in number to constitute a determined attack? Well, yeah, I thought so too. Bingo. Ow. Freya, the town's in trouble. You gotta come back, please. No, my fears were true. At once, my lord. Come on, you deadweights, hustle. You heard him. Let's go.
was weird they kept throwing soldiers at us when they have all these black mages. I did not read that dialogue at all. No mercy for the, the clerics. Ill. Oh. Please save us. The town's full of demons. Are there really that many? They just keep coming. Ah! Kill. Two ninety seven when I'm breaking a thousand with a critical slam. Ha! Ah, they got nothing on me. The town's in trouble. We're going to be presented with a series of choices here. Enemies are up, are on their way up. How about on your side? The Promethians are fighting back, but the demons keep coming. We fled, unable to resist any longer. Damn those Alexandrians! What are we to do? I'm gonna head right. Depending on your choices here, I can 
and save more villagers than uh, based on what you choose. Excuse me, have you seen my husband? No, I sure haven't. Daddy's gone. What? I'm gonna go to the left. Let's go left. You won't get by me. Zidane's weapon now. I can't hold them off forever. Are we safe now? No more monsters? No, we are not safe yet. We're not safe yet, so stay alert for more. Ah, no! I knew it wasn't over yet. Huh? What are you guys doing here? We like this place very much. Even though we have lost the soul-soothing view of the sandstorm. Yeah, I think it's pretty too. This whole town is pretty. And everyone here is so nice. That's why I want to protect you. Come on, let's head to the cathedral. We can make our stand there. are the only survivors. Where's the high priest? Where's the king? Where's dad? Why? I hope they're all safe inside the cathedral. All 
Alright, everyone. Inside. They're back. Yeah, ow. Over there. Damn it. We're surrounded. save them all. Minions of evil, you have gone too far. My spear will purge this land of you. You shall fall like leaves in the wind under the force of my blade. Did that look easy? Now run! Don't know who you are, but I owe you one. Sir Frantley, I... I have missed you so much. I began my search for you immediately after you left Bermesia. Where have you been all these years? What corners of the world have you traveled? My dear Fratley, I climbed the highest mountains only to hear rumors of your victories. I searched the deepest valleys only to find your footsteps. But I never found you. And in the end, I heard something. Something unbearable. Freya, you say? I believe this is the first time we have met. What did you just say? I'm sorry, but I cannot remember you for the life of me. Y you jest. You cannot have forgotten me. It's me, Freya. Freya of Bermesia. I am sorry. No. Hey, wait a minute. You can't be serious. It's Freya, your lost love. How could you forget her? Well, say something. That is enough, Sadan. What? You've been searching for this guy for years, and now he's right here. Bratley. You remember me, the King of Bermesia. Not at all, I'm afraid. Impossible. Have you forgotten everything that has passed? And let me ask you this. What brought you back to Bermesia? Is it not because you learned of the crisis here in Clara, whose people are our brothers? As a matter of fact... As a matter of fact, I'll tell you. Fuck. I found Fratley during my travels around the world. And you guessed it. He didn't know who I was. Or even who he was. But when Bermesia was attacked and he heard that Clara was in danger, his faint memories as a Dragon Knight called him back here. Dragon Knight. Yes, I was once called that. But now, that is all I can remember. Fratley. I must go. Freya, aren't you gonna follow him? No. I am happy simply knowing that Sir Fratley still lives. I'm sorry, Freya. I knew you weren't ready to see him, but with Clara under attack and all, I need no such courtesy, Highness. Uh, well, I'm gonna go after Fratley. Later. Wait, Puck, I've not seen you in ages. What? what? That was Puck? So what happened? What's the matter, Freya? Are you crying? Ah, ha, ha, ha. What irony. To find the man about whom I have dreamt endlessly. Only to discover that he cannot remember, even remember, who I am. Come, Zidane. The enemy's hand has not been stilled. We must regroup. Freya. Eek! Eek, have mercy. <laughs> Pathetic rodents. Fail to grasp the true power of this jewel. A magic stone. Now that I have this jewel, I'm through with your city. Wait. Halt, villain. Alright. We're gonna stop here. If you, uh, you followed the right, left, right, and no options while escaping, 
the uh, black mages, then you should have gotten a, an achievement or a trophy to pop for saving uh, saving everyone that can be saved. We'll save and quit here and finish up the, uh, the Siege of Clara on the next episode. I'm looking forward to seeing, seeing where we go from here. Although I guess I know it's not a blind playthrough, but the game is really starting to pick up here, and it's it's not so much the the happy-go-lucky adventure it began as. Thanks for joining, and I will catch you next time.